Alrighty, here we are, Hogwarts Legacy. Time to go back to the Wizard World. After many years of, away from Harry Potter or any of that shit. Oh, there you go, first word would. Nope. Yeah, so here we are, gonna go play this game completely blind. Well, I say completely blind, but yeah, pretty much <laughs> completely blind. Um, yeah, so let's see what we go. In terms of. We are pleased to inform you you have been accepted into at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. Term begins on September 1st. Prelim preliminary supplies have been collected for you and you will accompany you on your journey to the castle. As you are aware, the decree of responsible restriction of underage sorcery prohibits use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside school. You think he'd get this, um, the character would get this beforehand, but oh well. <clears throat> However, due to, um, due to unique circumstances, the Ministry will graciously agree to allow Professor Flake to accompany, to allow homeschool your spellcasting to accompany. Yeah. Your specifically, Professor Weasley, Deputy Headmistress. Oh. I didn't realise that Weasley was Deputy Headmistress in this time, but let's, let's go. Right, now to create our character. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, you know what I might do? I might try and get this guy to, to be like a young Tommy Shelby. So definitely not him or him. Um, let's see what we got. Uh, can I change the hair? Oh, yeah, I can. Okay, so. Yeah, let's go with that. Face shape. Hmm. <laughs> okay, that was it. That was a wild trans transition then. So let's get to like uh, about yeah, about there. I think that's about right. Wait, what glass else in the got? Hmm. Yeah, I don't need that. Let's go with hairstyle. So. Let's see. <laughs> okay. I can be like fucking Terry Silver from the uh, Cry Kid. Right. Uh, no. I could just be a skinhead. Oh, look, I'm Carl, I'm Carl from Shameless. Uh, let's go with... No. Yeah, yeah, let's go with that. I love the point out that we're supposed to be 15. Why have we got so much scars? <laughs> Oh, hair colour as well. <laughs> that, oh my god, I can get like, fucking all sorts of colours. You think at this point they wouldn't um, allow that, but oh well. Yeah, let's go with that. Uh, scars. No. Oh god. <laughs> Uh, wait, what freckles can I have, actually? Uh, let's just go with... Yeah, let's go with that. Whatever. Not really bothered. Oh, 
light color. Wait, what? Why is it? Oh, I thought it was second. I thought. Let's go blue. Hmm. Sorry about that. Oh, it's just cutting out. Um, hmm. I don't know what icons have. Uh, let me just. Hang on. Finalize your character. I'll put. I'll put it to like a uh, normal difficulty because why not? Um. Let's just go. I tell you what, let's just uh, go with. Uh, eyebrow color. <laughs> oh my! Oh my God! I'm super saying free. <laughs> I've got no eyebrows. Uh, let's go with that. That was quite something. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. I I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. <coughs> a few cobwebs and some dust. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's terrifying. That was quite something. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Let's go with... It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Uh, let's go with T Timmy Shelby. <laughs> Tommy. Wait, no. I, wait, hang on. I should have changed the bullet. T I realise I should have changed it like um, bullet tooth Tony or <laughs> break. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, let's go with Tommy Shelby, why not? Uh, wait, I need to sort of eye colour out, actually. Let's go with that. Make sure I've got everything I want. Let's just double check what hair, other hairstyles I've got. Is 
See, they don't have that long... Yeah, so let just go. Let's go with yeah. Let's just go with that. No, no, don't no worry. There you are. Go with that. Let's go with that one. <laughs> there you go. Tommy Shelby is a wizard. <laughs> there you go. Pop doesn't look like him at all. <laughs> It appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> Eliazar! George, glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. <laughs> I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. Sorry, Steve. <laughs> Though I, confess I, I saw Steve Bonnet from, like, um, Black Flag. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatre goers in the West End. <laughs> mm. It's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We had a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Oh, I feel like I should be... Oh. Oh yeah, we're running festivals because um, we haven't seen death yet. Dun, dun, dun. We try protesting this game because it's transphobic. Oh. Oh, I didn't realise the um, Wizard World logo had the Elder Wand and um, all the other like ones and that like um, what's it called? Lucius Malfoy's one. There's a snakehead. You left for Scotland. <laughs> Just barely. <laughs> and who is your travelling companion? Is it his little slave? New. Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary! It oh, no. is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive <laughs> and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? I have Hello. How are you doing? As to how great a threat Ranrock really is. <laughs> Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And... It was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Everything. Before it's I a conspiracy. Respond, received this. 
It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Yep, then you won't even see that glow, it's Tommy Shelby himself. Wait! We do Jesus Christ! Well that dragon's just uh that came out of nowhere. I like, I like that transition, like, as we've seen someone die, we can actually see the festivals just appear out now. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, ju yeah, guys, jump, <laughs> jump. The key! Give me your hand! Well, that's, that's handy, that was a port key. <laughs> That was very handy. Otherwise, we'd be fucked. <laughs> oh, the greatest evil of all time, a squirrel. You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Oh, is our healing mechanic? Wigan World Potion. Heal. Okay. Got four. Well, three now. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... Oh, fuck. I can't believe you've done attacking? this. Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? Sir, where are we? I'm oh. not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. Okay, I think and let's move. If you'd like to look around a bit, I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Okay, we're actually moving us. Okay, don't mind. Sensitivity's alright. Hmm, just make sure it's on the right start of it, but it's not too bad. London and the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. So, those ruins. Hmm. Do you the port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's yeah, why not? Let's just take this uh, teenager on this, this teenager on a uh, dangerous adventure. Well, this will harden his ability to lead the Peaky Blinder, so I shall accept this great Where task. A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten oh, okay. form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hmm. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key. <coughs> But I am certain it was to do with that search. Oh, oh shit. there's the path down below. This way. Oh yeah. Okay. Now let's, let's carry on. 
Why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding Jump. world. Jump. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Yeah. Is that so basically, a man has to have no limitation. It appears to be a sort of thing. But as Tommy Shelby, I have no limitations. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that one work you were practicing. Right. Focus on the center. That's correct. Bath basic cars. Okay, so that's how you, uh, some players prefer to target avatar with the same thumbs there by disabling um target range is correct. Okay. We'll give it a try, see how it goes. That's a bit rougher than I'd expected. Your one works oh. improving with every cut. Thank okay. you. Okay. Birds. <laughs> Fuck off, birds. Ah, up there. Good thing we're gonna parkour, otherwise this will be a bit of a disaster. Now it's just ahead. Steady yourself. Repair. Mm. Thank you, Professor Fig. My God, that guy's got energy. The frim. <laughs> Almost there. Gone. Got you, bus. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That portkey led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Okay. Okay, mini map um chase around there in the middle, you're in the middle, the objectives on Okay. Okay, so that's good. What's that? Professor, this statue... This may have been his home! Hmm. Okay. Okay. Let's just... Oh, just create some more damage. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! Oh, okay. Wait, do I? Oh, no, I have to wait for him to come in. How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? Hmm. I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. Right, let's just give it a touch. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Wait, is this a green box? Oh, that. What? Hello. Wow, poor guy, just sleeping on a job. <clears throat> just wake him, just... That's better. It can't be.
Uh, just a moment. <laughs> Ooh. Hello, Warwick. Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <coughs> Precisely. <laughs> yes, we're just we're just gonna the just key. gonna rob. Mm -hmm. Your wife's portkey. Oh, yes, of course. <sighs> This way, then. Wait, don't port keys just teleport you like the second you touch it? I could be wrong, but just, yeah. After you. Okay. Uh, keep your hands inside the cart. If you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> uh, maybe I do. So, yeah. Screw you. <laughs> How many votes are there? Hundreds. Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite hmm. a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. Oh, wow. You I've got a, ca a character transition. A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. Oh, so that's how... Oh, yeah, I forgot. That's, um... How in the, like... In Deathly Hallows Part 2, when the, um, the Imperius Curse was washed off the, um... The bank out. Of that, um, goblin. Boy. What's these vermin doing out in here? <laughs> Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. Get out of my sight. Not you, you little pinky blinder scumbag. It's so, alright, I'll, I'll give you the next bookies. Next uh, bet on the bookings. We get some plenty of goblin gold from that slur. That god was where it was glowing. Like the glow you saw in the porky container. No, darker. I saw that same glow in the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Hmm. Can't wait, to can't wait to learn um, the, some of the dark spells now, because apparently they're the most powerful in the game, like the killing curse is just bro broken as shit. A goblin <laughs> stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no <coughs> has visited Vault 12. Until today. Thank you for your help. Hmm. You're welcome, my good sir. Let's, all right, in we go. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Well, that's... Um... That's generous, so you just lock us in a vault. Best of luck. <laughs> no, best of luck. Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. 
Revelio. Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Oh, okay. Um. Oh shit. Okay, so. Oh, have I got pressed? Wait, what? <laughs> oh, 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 I'm a, I'm, oh, I'm, I'm thick. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm just thick. <laughs> Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. Oh, I see. Um, so you learn some spells and you can put them on your hotbar. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same <laughs> glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. It's got the bodily of Madeleine McCann. After all these years, it was here all along. Lumos. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out. Revenge. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. Hmm. But to what end, I can't <laughs> say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of green box. Okay, let's go. I see something up ahead. Oh. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Revelio. Hmm. Right, let's see what we got here. Determine how to proceed. When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Um. Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue. Yeah. What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Let's see. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the oh. floor. Yeah. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's position still not match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Okay, so let's go up there, down there, and there you go. You acquired the um, one lightning charm, Lumos, which automatically means to you spell hotspot. Lumos, well done. Oh, I see. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Oh. <laughs> so, oh, so it follows. Wait. Oh, I've got to face it towards that direction. Yeah, there you go. Oh, so let's keep that on. Then what we Huh Nope, oh, that's a lot of statues. The weep oh god, the weeping angels have come to life. Ooh. Oh god. <laughs> okay. I get fucked. Yep, take that out, you bastard. 
Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> no, Professor Big, no. I'll keep, I'll, keep, I'll keep blocking when there's no need to. Stay close, Rebellion. Lose. Oh, what's that over there? Professor, Professor Fig, Professor. Oh, where coins. Are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? Wait. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Lumos. Some more coins. Rebellion. Lumos. Okay, I'll go over there. Hang on, let me just get this. That's where they're leading me. That glow again. Let's get some. Let's just steal this money. Thank you. Go and take this. Okay. Let's take the statues. Have I got a? So wait, if I, I've got to run away from the then I'll spawn. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Wait. What? Rebellion. I'm on my own this time. Okay. Lumos. So they got to face this direction, have they? Oh, so I've got. Oh no, hang on, I've got to go in a certain spot. Shit. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. No, you don't, you bastard. Oh. Yeah, I thought I was in controls. Sorry, I, I'm Tommy Shelby. I have. Uh, I've got Spidey Sense. So I'm a man with no limitations. No, you don't. Eat. Hold your in Protego to stun enemies with stupid fight. With stupid fight. Oh. Okay. Come on, come on. What can that? Oh shit. Oh sweet. Go on, go on, attack, attack. Good pop up. Thank you. I like this tutorial. Kill this. Like a boss. Okay, so that's Lumos. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Hmm. Okay, is there anything around here? No. Nope. Okay. okay, that's cool. Here we go.
Let's investigate this shit. <laughs> World's greatest weed. Oh, that's a poncet. Uh, there you are. How did you... What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for oh, yeah. memories. I wonder. What? Follow my lead. Too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. That's it will be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles. The witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. Hmm. Time to extract all that shit out of our mind. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, mm. but could never. Never prove it, eh? Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems are the key to understanding why. We won't all look so rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Hello there, Great Boris. Luck. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <clears throat> uh, sir, they had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must uh, insist. I dude, was granted access only yeah, to the key, and you didn't have Yeah, I wouldn't... Yeah. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? Uh, you're about to get I'm your ass kicked. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. I know my 
Come on. Come on, Figgy. Come on, you got parkour, son. You got parkour. Go, 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 go. Jump, you. Oh. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Hmm. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both, wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Well, good thing that sign was there, otherwise we'd be lost in the Forbidden Forest. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, that's, that's fucking sick. Porky, Porky Games, Hogwarts Legacy. Roll credits. Oh wow, the uh, loading screen is all the um, all the uh, what's it called logos, the um, lion, the f falcon for Raven. Wait, isn't Ravenclaw an, e an eagle or a falcon? I can't remember because it's not a uh, raven. Um, and that's a badger. <laughs> Come on, load, load, <laughs> load. Let me get into sorting. I need to actually decide what I want to be. I think I might be go for uh, Slytherin. Yeah, fuck it, I'll go for Slytherin, why not? Oh, good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more. Appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening hmm. between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Put, put. Oh yeah, that's the biggest asshole. Yeah, <laughs> he's not. Prepare yourself to meet the He's headmaster. like one of the worst headmasters in uh, Hogwarts history. So, sort of. nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has. Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. Oh, sorry. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Hmm. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. All right, here we go. Right. Um. 
Let's see. What to be sorted into? Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Mm. Certain expectations. Uh, let's go with... I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Mm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. True. Mm. I wonder... Mm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Hmm, what is it? Hmm. Um... Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. You recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. Hmm, yeah. Yeah, fuck it, why not? Let's go Slytherin. You belong in Just because you're eager for power doesn't make you a complete arsehole. That's... Oh, that's nice of the Gryffindors, considering we, we hate each oh, other. And one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Oh, wow. Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Yep. All right. All right, Tossa. <laughs> Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As <laughs> I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Ah, oh. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honour to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Hmm. Well done. You know what? I should actually change now, it to John Kreese and like start my <laughs> karate. <laughs> Go co Cobra Kai <laughs> instead. Do my fucking karate. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. I'm just going to have evil schemes <laughs> on how I'm going to ru rule the world. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Okay. Oh, this is actually pretty. It's nice seeing the um, Slytherin's uh, common room. 
After I do this uh, playthrough, I might actually just go and play um, the Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw one, just to see what that one's like. I suppose some introductions are in order. Hmm. This bit. That is not helpful. Oh, hello, Sebastian. Can I help you? Oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs, who merely joined us for the ride. Still, impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. Hmm. Professor Fig and I were lucky to escape with our lives. Indeed. And how did you escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. What are you, are you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but <laughs> not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough, but not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. True, yeah. Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? Which ones? Seems I may have met a kindred spirit. <laughs> that is a conversation for another time. It was good meeting you. Good luck today. Okay, so... I'm guessing he, we're going to learn some stuff from when doing stuff with him, so we're going to lose him. Hello. Oh, is it I'm, I'm Dealer? Ugh, oh, I'll just I'll let it pronounce the name. Are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, good. <laughs> okay. Told you. You should have listened to me. Ah, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, hmm. by the way. Shame I wasn't with you in Amanda. the day. I could have I'm lured I'm that I'm dragon away. Jesus Christ. My skills in a room are legendary. We handled it. And I think you're underestimating the nature of a dragon. A broom would have been kindling. <laughs> <laughs> Not the way I fly. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can hmm. teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. There's oh. nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, hmm. it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. Oh, so it's There's just, yeah, okay, so it's just repeating. The, um... of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Goodbye, Amelda. Nice meeting you. Hmm. I really hope we get to see, or at least hear more today. Also, Miss Go. Oh. Oh. Okay. That's interesting. I, I, I heard one. Because that's um Voldemort's ancestor. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm ominous. Ominous What's up with your eyes? <laughs> nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. <laughs> well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> You're definitely in the right house. Uh, Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate you, you your first day. Yeah, you're not looking right, right my sir. Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? <laughs> Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Yep, it's you, and you're a parcel son. Something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status, a pure blood maniac. 
Unfortunately, huh. most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. <laughs> oh, poor. Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. I don't think I will be, because it's you, sir, are very important. Here. Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Oh, fucker. <laughs> right, up we go. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are hmm. here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of oh, the Oh yeah, forgot my lives. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Okay. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage right. of this okay. exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Hmm. This way. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Okay. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Do keep up. Uh, uh, I'm right here, bitch. <laughs> what the? Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue and see what details the field guide? Revelio. Has. Field guide. Keep it a bit. Large keyword reported a lot and sponsored in Scotland. Oh. Okay. That's not. You've got the field guide challenge. Uh, your progress will just continue here. Okay, you're wasting XP. Like, increase the challenges. Okay, so you've got different challenges and stuff. Let's see. Let's have a look. Got a combat, quest, field guide, prep. Okay, so I've got to keep track on like all that sort of stuff, and it will just like. Close, uh, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle. Jump, jump. Oh sweet! So this is the um, hot bar stuff then. So you get. Rebellion. Oh, okay. My first ah. is 
Good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Oh, Your a fast travel system, yes. The castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Let's go flu networks. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. Left side is where students and professors live. Also includes the House Commons and the Great Hall. Central, select the central staircase. Oh, so divination classroom, potions classroom, library, greenhouse. Wait, is that? Oh, that's was good. First, great hall. <sighs> and here we are, quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Well, that's handy. <sighs> you can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive, our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against oh, the Dark Arts classes. Good. Today. Good start. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, Charms, charms Jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. Evil. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Then Hog see what Hogs You mentioned Hogsmeade, <laughs> Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. And get drunk. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon hmm. attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil? Professor Fig! Your ears must have been burned. <laughs> oh. Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon. 
its part. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, it would seem that it. Enough chit chat. I need to ask myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Yep. Invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Oh, because you get my proper wand as well. Right, well, I'm looking at 71 minutes. Eh, okay. uh, could do it longer. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Mm. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between yeah, us. Yeah, no, I saw Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Mm. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay. Oh, whoops. Uh, it's, 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 it's. Some quests are locked by spell requirements, and that in cases what you need. Charms class. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, mm. sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a mm. good friend. I shall reach out when that I ma have that man has lasted for eternity. Mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Okay, let's go to charms first. Okay, it's pretty cool. Wait, oh, I got to press it. Oh, just press X. The off on another adventure, are we? Rebellion. Okay, I, oh, I can't interact with it. It's just. Rebellion. 
that knife. Okay, that guy sounds like he's having issues. Oh, hello, Fig. Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Some of us don't necessarily want him to get back to the lesson. My older brothers were all taught to trade the class. Alright, let's, let's begin. Here, behind you, there is an open seat here. Thank you. Hmm. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of chant. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right? Now, everyone, please open your textbook. You know, if, page five, one, seven, if teachers five, were like this in real life, then I feel like kids will just, you know, tell me the pay more attention the and actually just have a good laugh as well. Color change and growth charms. I mean, then again, it depends on it. Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Oh, come on. Hmm. <laughs> come on, guys, you got to <laughs> It seems that we are in dire need of review. <laughs> Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Hmm. Okay, so let's go. Right, Axio. Accio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Hmm. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me! <laughs> that, that's nice of him. Okay, he seems like a, seems like a nice little bloke, doesn't he? I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? Oh, okay, so, so why don't we have our I get this. Start us off. Hmm? Eh? Right, I'm, I'm going to be yeah. fucking shit at this. <laughs> Very simply, cast Akio Hold on to and recast. And relinquish your charm at the last time. Now, very good. Not to worry. Akio. That's it. Fuck sakes. Excellent control. Very 
Very good. Points to Slytherin. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Okay. <laughs> Wait, so I've got a hot... You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Okay. No, 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 you bastard! Oh, you fucker. Oh, shit. Okay, I'll... <laughs> Yeah, I, I, I don't care. <laughs> I'm a noob. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Okay. I think okay, I think I got it down. I think I got it down. <laughs> okay, oh no you don't you little bitch. Oh, oh, yeah get fucked. Noob. Wait, okay let's wait for them, wait for that to go. No! <laughs> no! God damn it! Happens to the best of us. So close. <laughs> Very good, both of you. Well done. God damn it. <laughs> Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Well done back there. You took the loss in stride. Didn't want to go too easy on you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. <laughs> That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when <laughs> I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Is Wagadu much bigger hmm. than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. 
It's always felt like home. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me, this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses Wait, one. so you... You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. Hmm. It seems very dramatic. Okay. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Yeah, no, I know I failed, all right, Sean. <laughs> If you're so inclined. Well, you'd be using it on clothing, to be precise, Sebastian. You know it won't work on humans. Hmm. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? Hmm. Miss Onai is a talented witch. Take it in stride. One often gains the most from the battles one has lost. Of course, Professor. It was a challenging match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for okay. you. Thank you. Thank you, mate. Gear. And where? Face wire. I'll probably sell that. Headwear. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, okay, I'm keeping that. Yeah, I'm going to keep that on. <laughs> uh, see. Wait, shit, have I not. Have I, oh, I've, I've, I've not equipped it. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, nah, for, yeah, I'll keep that on. Oh, you get, oh, you get flying mouse and stuff, nice. Um, collections. Okay, right. Assignment, obviously. Got defense against dark arts. student aren't you oh hello hello you wanted to speak to me Samantha Dale I've been eager to meet you you're the student everyone's been whispering about hmm. hope your first day is going well you certainly seem to hold your own in charms 
<laughs> I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. Mm. My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. That sounds like Again, fucking. Um, he tends to be overconfident oh. in his. Diane, well, what's her name from Peaky Blinders? I'm afraid I can't count on. You know, uh, Mosley's wife, Odin. Oswald Mosley's wife. Oh, uh, cheers, love. Thank you. And then the werewolves joined the goblins Goblin in the upfront. Where oh, hello, please. <laughs> and by the end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling I'm lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. Oh, it was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <laughs> Good old uh, Peeves. Peeves are poultry guys. What a, like the tosser of the world. Take right. Uh, yep, I'm going to call it a session. I shall see you guys next time on Hogwarts Legacy, and yeah, we'll be doing Defense Against Dark Arts. I'm enjoy enjoying the story so far, so yeah. I'll see you guys later, and yeah, peace out. Bye.